Describe Coach Daly and Coach <laughs> Boyer's relationship. <laughs> I would describe, I don't even know how to describe Coach Daly and Boyer's relationship. Um, the Coach Boyer, Coach Daly relationship, it's, it's hilarious. Top, top three. Top three. Six of what? Six of what? Six of what? Top three. Okay. Top three. Coach Boy, oh God. Coach Boy and I are like a married couple. I don't know. Sometimes they're like an old married couple, but a successful one. They can be the best of friends, and then sometimes they're just like bickering back and forth. But when they bicker, it's just so funny. To chill, okay? You need to chill, okay? We go at it, you know? She is one that allows me to be me. And I I allow her to be her. She's a nagger. Um, she's, she's a talker. She's the opposite of me. With Donnie? Uh, you know, Don and I have known each other a very long time. And, um, you know, we, we first met uh, in the ABL. She played for me. And Don always says that I took years off of her life but she surely has caught up at this point because she has taken multiple years off of my life. They balance each other, you know, I really do. Like, I really think that from somebody outside looking in would seem Boyer is like a really like high anxiety kind of person and she just has to have things done a certain way and I think Coach Shelley kind of helps to calm that. But um, at the same time, I think Boyer kind of helps, you know, Coach Daly's motor get going a little bit and um, she's always staying on time, on track, so it's interesting to watch, you know, it's, it's a different dynamic just because they're two completely different people. I thought I had some weird relationships with my teammates and friends, but they have a very interesting relationship. But it's so funny, like they have completely different personalities, but at the same time they're still kind of the same person. And it, I look at it as like Boyer's like Coach Staley's mom, like, come on Don, like sit down, or like, Don, we should do this, and Coach Staley's like, no, I'm not listening. So but Boyer's like, okay, like she just doesn't even, she just sees through Coach Staley. When I look back, it's just, it's hard for me to believe that this is, it's been 20 years this year that I've known Dawn. When I first even knew about Dawn, I was a college coach and she was a phenomenal player. To have that opportunity that I had to coach her, but now when I coach with her, you know, we're, we're basically on the same page when it comes to the, you know, the X's and O's. Um, at the same time too, you know, we, we disagree and we can have some knockdown drag outs and you know, an hour later it's, it's, it's forgotten. And, I think that's how you are with friends. He's one of my best friends. And we talk basketball, we talk life, we talk, you know, we talk fashion, we talk politics. Uh, we, we talk about it all. And I, I know that, you know, if I want a, a straight answer, um, whether she agrees with me or not, she's gonna give me a straight answer. She's been, you know, you know, the ultimate sacrificer, you know, for her to help me in my career. Um, is quite, you know, admirable. She coaches our, you know, our, our young ladies to the point of, you know, like they're, they're her children. She wants them to be so successful, um, you know, that, you know, she screams a little bit. She, uh, she hugs up on them a little bit. She's very, very positive with them. Um, so she's, she's got a great balance of, of making sure they, they feel both sides of her. I'm the warrior on the team or on the staff, I'm always, you know, she's like, Boyer, whatever happens, we'll deal with it. You know, it comes our way for a reason and we're gonna be able to handle it. And, um, you know, she's been right. I mean, it's, it's true, you know, we're gonna handle whatever comes our way and we're gonna handle it together and we're gonna move forward. But if you are gonna have anybody in, in, in battle with you, she'd be my first choice. That's my girl right there.